Today's vlog is sponsored by In No Cheer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's still got the film on there. Shit. Dang. <laughs> I thought it had no more film. Okay, I'm pause it. You can pause it. This part is hard. You keep getting what? Yeah, it's okay. She spent hours playing with this, so if you're looking for something similar to entertain your kids for the summer, definitely check out Inno Chair. This is actually on sale on Amazon right now for $6.99. It's definitely affordable, it's definitely fun. It's something for all the kids to do, even my bigger kids enjoyed it. So yeah, and if you're interested, the link will be in the description box. Go order you one and right now. Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, and today we are going to be doing Araya's hair. This hairstyle was seen by my by Araya. She wanted um, a different hairstyle. Um, I was scrolling on either Facebook or Instagram or YouTube, one of the two, and she seen this hairstyle and she said she wanted it. So I said, sure, why not? So we're going to do like a side corn roll with some beads. And yeah, um, all the um, products that I use will be linked down in the description box if you guys are interested in using them as well. Vitalizer, uh, that's the one in me Mega Thick, and I'm also using Eco Styler um, for her hair as well. I, I, we stumble and fall. handling the summer vacation with all the kids I know it's not really any much of a difference because the kids have been pretty much home all year last year so I know the summer is not really much of a difference but I know in certain parts of the country some of y'all are really experiencing some heat so how are you guys staying cool with the kids how are you guys keeping the kids entertained with the heat because I know in some places um, it's not even 
worth going outside because of how hot it is. Um, but yeah, with us, uh, we've just been keeping cool with the water um, and some fans. And we also been um, just making sure that the kids are comfortable by allowing them to sleep downstairs in the living room because we, as many of you guys know, they live, in, they sleep in the attic and their rooms are extremely hot. So yeah, we pretty much just been doing like sleepovers <laughs> well to a riot it's a sleepover <laughs> but really it's just um them just finding a spot that's comfortable for them and going to sleep um that's pretty much how we've been trying to beat the heat around here in these parts many of you don't know especially if you're new to my channel I actually despise doing hair. I have four girls and I hate doing hair. I even have long hair. My hair is all the way down my back and I hate doing hair. Um, and this is the reason why I started doing cornrows, especially on Arise hair. Because one, she does not like getting her hair done. Two, she is tender headed. And three, I just don't like doing hair. So by allowing me to do like these protective hairstyles on her hair, it makes my life so much easier. Um, I used to do the same thing for my older girls when they were um, this age and I want to say about until about fifth grade, fifth, sixth grade. That's when they was like, we want to do our own hair. Um, I used to do different hairstyles, ponytails, beads, braids. I grew up on this. This is my whole life. Um, when I was a kid in the summer times, I used to have to get the micro cornrows for the summer camp and I used to hate it. When I tell y'all I hated it. Um, so I, I refuse to do it on myself, but for my girls, I understand the benefit of it. And that's why, um, I do it for them. Um, since I started braiding Arai's hair, her hair grew so much. If you guys remember before when I was not doing her hair, um, not braiding it, um, her hair was really short. It was breaking. There was, um, sections that were broken off, um, especially in the back because of her rubbing her head. And it's the same issue I'm dealing with right now with Azara. So yeah um she's gonna have to get the same treatment with her hair so that her hair can grow but yet yeah, corn rolling her hair has really made a huge difference um using grease oils i use the eco styler only because it makes it um not as flaky and dry and nasty and gooky like most gels For the colors of the beads she just wanted rainbows so, so i just randomly picked different colors i made sure there was a white on the top and a white on the bottom just so that i can get an understanding of how many beads are in there but yeah she just wanted a different rainbow style so i went with it hey i let the girl do what she wants to do if it's safe and healthy and, and it makes her look cute you know what i'm saying sometimes you gotta pick and choose your battles when it comes to toddlers y'all don't don't argue with the four-year-old now I know a lot of people have an opinion about baby hairs and edges and all that. I personally don't like it. I grew up in the 90s and I just, I'm over it. I'm tired. Of, I don't want to see it come back. I'm tired of it coming back. Bye -bye. Yeah, look. I like it. <laughs> Can I get out? No, hold on. Let me see the back. Turn, turn the other way. Let me see the back. Wow. Look at that. Wow. And then if you want, you can put a ponytail in it, and you can have a bowl. Can I have a bowl? Yeah, go go get pick out your bowl. Okay, I think I have it. In the meantime, I'm gonna clean up this mess. <laughs> so this is the end results. She picked this type of bowl that she wanted to wear with it. Uh, I, I found these bows on Amazon that will also be linked down in the description box I found also bows for the baby girl um, and I'll link those as well if you guys are interested and yeah um, I hope you guys enjoy give this video a thumbs up 
share it if you feel like this was helpful um and subscribe make sure you subscribe join the family become our friends and yeah i'll see you on the next video bye